can't go to prison, guys. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna get raped. Like, like a hundred percent. And not just because like I'm a small guy, but because like I'm Asian, you know. We make up only like five percent of the population. There's no Asians in prison. You know what I mean? <laughs> prison is separate by race, you know. Like, what's the last time you saw like an American prison movie? And there's that like gang of Asians there trying to get like white protagonists. Yeah. It, it doesn't exist, right? <laughs> and that's what we're talking about, right? You know. And American prison movies, they depict it pretty well, you know, like there's the blacks, there's the white skinheads, there's the Mexicans, you know, there's no gang Asians with their Yakuza tattoos and black belts on their heads, like, oh, <laughs> this is the Asian gang, what is it? What the fuck with this? It doesn't exist, bro, like, I'm gonna get raped, 100%, you know, who's gonna win? Me or 10 big black dudes, who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? You know, me or like 10 skin white heads. If I go to prison, man, I'm Mexican, straight up, that's exactly what I am, I'm fucking Mexican, dude. <laughs> what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, Oh really? Oh yeah, what are the homes? You know, you know, as Mexicans, we gotta stick together. You know, we don't have to back in Mexico. We family, you know. So the Mayo, you know what I mean? <laughs> family, you know? Get it? Oh, I don't feel like to speak Spanish today. They just keep it English. You don't get it simple. You know what I mean? I gotta stay all complicated, fool. You know what I mean? What you mean I'm not a real Mexican? I'm a real fucking Mexican. I say, fuck out. I ain't no fucking Chino. I'm a real fucking Mexican. I say, this is my blood. I say, fuck out. This is my blood. I say, this is my blood. One of those fucking sickle says, this is my blood. I say. Fuck out of here. If that doesn't work, uh, I'll have to do like uh, a black people speech, you know? I'll have to be like, uh, my brothers! Uh, Us yeah. Asians and blacks are gonna stay together <laughs> during these hard times. Now, I know we've had our differences, but we've seen Dragon Ball Z, so that means something, right? <laughs> Is one little Asian man's bundle really worth it? Is it? I could be that alliance. Black and yellow. Black and yellow. Alright. I uh I did that I did that bid one time at a like open mic like this variety mic and then um this like uh woke white girl, I don't know, she just kinda like the part where I'm like, I'm about to do a black girl speech, this woke white girl got really upset and she was like, No, 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 that's that's racist. And I got kinda mad. Cause I was like kinda I felt like in a way she was kinda basically like saying like if like a bunch of black dudes decided to fuck me, you can't be like Obama, like while they like hold you down and shit. You know, like you can't be like you can't be like boys in the hood, right guys? Like, like it pissed me off. It pissed me off because it's like I'm making a hypothetical story of me getting raped and she's like taking their side and shit, you know? And she's just like, don't say Wakanda while it happens, and I'm just like, I, it pissed me off, dude. I was like, I can't even believe. You can even, I don't even know, but it made me mad. <laughs> Alright, uh, yeah, I was at a, I'm not, I'm not a virgin when it comes to certain drugs and sex, you know? Uh, certain drugs, not just sex, not sex, but just certain drugs and sex, like, and I would, like, go on Reddit and I'd, like, look for, like, the best drug to have sex on, you know? And I go through the forums and everything, and I get to, like, acid, for example, like, acid on sex. People be like, oh, it's super spiritual, it's super connecting, like whatever, right? I get to like Molly, and they're like, oh, it's like 40 orgasms at once. But then I get to like meth, and it's just a bunch of straight dudes willing to suck your dick for meth. Like, that's all it was. <laughs> you know, like, the first post is just like, if anyone's got any meth in here, I'll suck your dick right now. And then, like, a phone number, you know? <laughs> Second post is like, I used to think I was straight, but until I took meth, that's when I knew I could fuck other dudes. And a phone number. And the last one that had nothing to do with even like gay sex, it was just like, I'd rather jerk off on meth than have sex with my wife. And then just, like, a phone number, you know? <laughs> and that's what I do, like, meth is definitely the best sex to have sex on. 100%. Oh, yeah, that's, that's definitely true. Alright. <laughs> What'd you say? Minnesota's a meth state. Minnesota's a meth state? We're Really? I don't see too many, like, dizzy fucking method walk around. Like, I don't really see that. That's true. I'm a good boy. I'm, I'm Reddit, and you were singing on the street, so that makes a big difference. <laughs> makes a huge difference. I'm just being a good boy over here. Uh, I think I'll be done. You know, you guys have a beautiful day. I, mean, I don't really, I have, like, tiny jokes left, you know. I don't know. Okay, I'll say one more time. I hate it when dudes say no homo all the time. You guys ever hear dudes say no homo? Yeah.
Yeah, I hate that shit. I think I got a buddy of mine. He's always like, no homo, no homo, no homo. I'm just like, bro, you can just be gay. I don't care. Just be gay, dude. It's funny how you can say no homo, but you can't say no pedo. You know what I mean? It's like really weird. Like imagine like you're at a birthday party, and then like, a little five-year-old girl sits in your lap, you're just like, oh, no pedo. You know, it's like, that was really weird, dude. Like, now we gotta kill you, man. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> it's like, yeah, alright, I'm done. You guys have a beautiful <laughs>